So, uh, we start a place like this. You know, Sri Lanka is a Buddhist country. So, when does that, and that means, when Sri Lanka became a Buddhist country? Hmm, that's a question. Okay, I will give you the answer. In the 3rd century BC, in a possible poet, the introduction of Buddhism to Sri Lanka was happened by a by Arahat Mahinder. So, the full story is this. Um, you know, the king Devanampik was the ruler of the Sri Lanka and the Deva um, the king Empire Dharma Shoka was the king in um, India. So, uh, they, was, they were friends and they ha haven't seen each other but they are friends. Uh, in that time, Sri Lanka haven't any religion, language, no, they haven't any habitats. They haven't any habitats. So, because of that, the empire, the Dharma Shoka thought to, thought to bring the Buddhism to Sri Lanka. Um, that day was a uh, day like this. Um, that person called day. Um, the King Devanapit is uh, was uh, catching a deer with his um, you know the uh, enemies no he, with his army army so then uh, doing that he heard some sound called tissa tissa he it's a very strange voice to him he surprised and looked because you know the king ka, uh, the first people that can't talk uh, to king by his his name so he surprised and looked out like this. Oh, so what happened? He saw Arahat Mahinder with his um, other servants. Then he don't know who is that. Because of that, he asked who is that. Then the the servant, uh, that means the Thero, um, answered, uh, I am the son of Dharma Shoka, Dharma Shoka King, and I came to Lanka to um, introduce Buddhism. And after that, um, that the Thero have to, that means Thero wanted to realize that the uh, King Devanapit is an intelligent or not, because the Buddhism is a very, very, um, uh, it have to be understand very much. Because of that, he asked some questions. Uh, two questions the two questions are mango question and the other question is maternal paternal question and after that he uh, the terror realized that the king Devanapit is very intelligent and then uh, he pre uh, the terror preached Dhamma to King Devanapit in that time certain fact happened that is the first sutra teaching to Sri Lanka that sutra was Chulahati Padoma Sutra. And that sutra, um, so uh, that sutra was uh, preached to King Devanampiyatissa. Also, um, the army of him listened to it and they were, um, they were, they get a knowledge about Buddhism. And they, um, spread Buddhism around Sri Lanka. Uh, that's the second fact and I have another fact to tell. It is, I think you know that Sri Lanka has many many historical books. So, when does that books start? Okay, the starting was, that means the starting of Buddhism, the starting of uh, historical, that historical books like Mahavansha happened on a Person for a day also. It's a very interesting fact, you know. Okay, I think hope you get a good knowledge about the importance of person for a day. And I will tell that three facts again. First fact is introducing introducing of Buddhism to Sri Lanka, and the second fact is uh, preaching of 
Sutra of Tulhati Padana. And the next one is a starting of many many historical books. So, I think you get a good knowledge. Thank you.